Hey everyone, welcome back. Today's topic is about failure is temporary, but success is inevitable if you believe. Now remember, like, share, subscribe. Hit the notification bell to receive all my content. Leave a comment below to let me know how you feel about this subject. Your response is highly appreciated. Definition of failure, the state of inability to perform normal functions. You know, failure is something that we would all love to avoid in life. But unfortunately, we all must witness failure in more ways than one. But see, the important thing about failure is there's a lesson to be learned when we witness failure. And I have prepared for you four lessons that I've learned when going through failures. Point one, failure is life's greatest teachers. In order to grow, you need failure. It's life's ultimate lesson. Failure's gonna happen, no matter how hard you try to avoid it. So it's best to adapt a no fear attitude towards it. But that don't mean expect to fail. But if it happens, accept it. You know, it's a value in failure. Cause through failure, you can get to know yourself better and learn from your mistakes. Failure helps us to rethink, reconsider, and find ways and strategize on how to achieve our goal. Point two, failure can help you reach your potential. In order for you to reach your ultimate potential, your personal best, and make the impossible possible, you have to be willing to push through to get to your absolute limit. And definitely not fear failure, but embrace it to maximize your motivation, your determination, and your perseverance. Point three, failure brings character and humbles you you know nobody likes to fail it's bad for the ego failure humbles you and makes it easy for you to evaluate situations better you know when your ego is in charge it's hard for you to see the mistakes you've made and you're not open to other people's views but see the only way to see what needs to change in order for you to succeed, you have to learn how to listen and you have to learn how to evaluate situations. You see, your ego, it loves to be right. But see, that will get in the way of you and your success. So the only way to be successful is to accept that you was wrong, learn from the mistakes, evaluate the situation and move on. Point four, failure will determine the type of person you are. There's two types of people in the world. One who takes failure personally, accepts the situation as permanent and gives up. The other one learns a lesson, doesn't take it personally, accepts failure as a temporary setback. You know, Everyone goes through an emotional low when they have failed. It's normal, human, and invitable. But see, what's important is the way that you respond from failure will determine your journey to success. Now, if you have witnessed an emotional low from failure, you should read or listen to people like T.D. Jakes, Curtis 50 Cent Jackson and their journeys up to now. This will help with that emotional low from failure and give you that motivation to move on. Now I'm gonna leave you with a Bible scripture, Proverbs 20 and 30. It says, the blueness of a wound clears away all evil, so as the stripes of the inward parts of the belly. 
And I want to encourage you to embrace your failures. Learn the lessons that come with failure. These are the stepping stones to lead you to success. But you have to embrace these things and be knowledgeable of what's going on along the way. Thank you. How y'all doing? It's your boy, Glenn the God Chase, and welcome to another segment of Live Life Strong, Trust in God. And today's topic is how failure is temporary, but success is inevitable. And I'm here to encourage you to tell you that don't let your failures define you, but realize that success is inevitable. Just because you feel that certain, certain things in your life or some things that you weren't great at doesn't make you a failure in life. Success is inevitable as long as you believe, not only in yourself, but you believe in God. I'm here to encourage you and tell you that you will be great at something. You will be successful in life. And I have a couple key points that I hope will encourage you to believe this as well. And my first key point is approach. How are you approaching failure and success in your life? Are you so scared to fail that you don't even try? That's the wrong way to look at things. That's the wrong way to approach any obstacle, situation, dreams, or goal in your life. You're gonna have to realize you might fail once or twice before you actually accomplish that dream, that goal, or get over that obstacle. And even success. Many people say, oh man, I can't wait till I'm successful. But then they start to think about all the requirements and the things that they're gonna have to change to be successful. And they begin to psych themselves out like, I don't know if I could do that. That might be too much. That might be too much responsibility. I gotta change? That's the wrong approach to failure and success. So you wanna change and think about that and think, hey man, I gotta have a positive outlook on some of these things, even failure. Because even in your failures, it teaches you something. It allows you to grow. Even in success, it allows you to understand what it takes to be successful in life. So I want you to think about your approach. My second key point is keep trying. Keep going. Don't give up. You gotta be resilient. You gotta be hungry out here. You gotta be consistent to be successful in whatever you're trying to do in life. You can't say, oh man, all nonchalant about it. You can't be like, oh man, I failed. I ain't gonna try again. I done failed twice. You don't know what's gonna happen that third or fourth time you try. That's what I mean by like, you gotta keep trying. You gotta be hungry. You gotta keep going. You gotta keep going. No one else can define your success. No one else is, no one else is gonna get it out here for you. You gotta want it. Success will be inevitable as long as you keep going, as long as you keep trying, as long as you are determined. That's what I mean by like, you gotta keep trying. You gotta dust your feet off. You gotta dust the dirt off. You gotta get back up. No matter if people laughing at you, no matter if people making fun of you, no matter if people think you're not good at it, you gotta keep trying because success is inevitable. Failure is only temporary. So let those people laugh. Let those people mock you because you will be successful one day. And every great person that is great in the world or successful, whether it's a music star, an NBA player, a football player, they'll tell you themselves, they had to get up and keep trying. They had to train for it. They had to develop their skills. That's what I mean by keep trying, because over time you're gonna get better. But you gotta believe that. It's up to you to keep going. It's up to you to keep trying. And this brings me to my third point, define. Do not let anyone define your failures or your success in your life. This is your life. Do not let your failures define you. Do not let your failures discourage you. You gotta realize even in failure, it's a lesson. It should make you more hungry. Don't let these failures in life or some of the things that you're not good at allow you to walk away from everything. Don't do that. And do not let anyone define what success is in your life. We all in our own lanes out here. We all got our own race to run. And I'm not trying to get there faster than the next person. And you shouldn't either. So don't let anyone define what success is in your life. And I want to leave you guys with this Bible scripture, which is Proverbs 24 and 16. A righteous man falleth down seven times, but he rises again. And the wicked falleth away into mischief. God already know that you're going to fall a couple times. However many times it takes, but you better get back up. That is a very encouraging Bible verse right there. Get back up. Even a righteous man falls down seven times. So that means you're no different. 
God already knows that you're going to fail sometimes, but that doesn't make you a failure. The purpose of life is to keep getting back up. Don't stay on the ground. I hope you guys learned something today. Like, share, and subscribe, and realize failure is temporary, but success is inevitable. Hit that notification bell and let me know what you guys think.